Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to create some cool videos with Canva. Let's get started. Open up a workspace. You can open up a YouTube video or Reels or anything. And from here, we are going to just choose a video. If you have your own, use yours. And I will be using this uh, clouds video. I'm just going to put this as a background video. Now I'm going to choose this turtle video and then I'm going to remove the background of this so that I can get the turtle alone. So if you actually go to edit video, you'll be able to see this background remover. Use that and then remove the background, okay? It depends on how complicated your video is. If it is a simple video, you will have no problem. So if you're using your own videos, so when you're um, actually recording that video, make sure you use a green screen or white screen so that you will be able to um, work with uh, minimal noise actually. Okay, so here you can see that the turtle is flying very happily through the clouds. Okay, so this is basically how you create cool, cool videos. It's not like you can only incorporate two videos, you can incorporate more than that. Okay, another thing that we want to play around with is the timing. Okay, I'm going to add another video over here. So the, I just want to show you how you transition between a videos. Okay, so this video, I'm going to change the background slightly. Okay, I'm going to replace the background. From here, you can see that the turtle is going to fly through this foggy rainforest. Okay, so what we are going to do is we are going to play around with the timing. Okay, I'm just going to drag it all the way. Okay, just give me a minute. Okay, just drag it all the way and uh, just uh, keep it maybe around five seconds. You can actually adjust the timing at the playback section also. You can just uh, click on this uh, crop button over here and then you can just drag uh, to where you want to put it. And then if you are going to add a transition, just click on this uh, add transition button over here. And here you will be able to see a lot of transition options. From here choose I like this match okay so what it does is actually matches uh, from one transition to the other it will just it's it's very seamless so the, the lesser time we give it I think it's more seamless that way we can actually port this uh, you can actually duplicate this transition throughout our video so if I'm actually going to replace another video I'm going to add another video and replace the background same thing and I'm going to add the transition over here match and move okay it's going to be the same so it is actually going to just match it it depends on how how you want to transition so choose your own and you see how the effect is okay so uh, keep it uh, really nice uh, from here you'll be able to see that no it's actually a really cool video see how it transitions so you play around with the timing play around with the video options and so on Okay, I will show you another thing. Here I need you to focus on something that is very important. When you're choosing your video or when you're recording your video, you need to make sure that uh, you are fitting into the whole frame. Fitting into the whole frame means uh, that uh, your head is not cut off, your hands are not cut off and things like that. So you need to be uh, extra careful. You see this girl I chose specifically because uh, when she is turning around, you can see that her head is slightly chopped off at the, at the top. So, you know, it, it actually kind of shows that it's two videos actually cropped into one. So, in the beginning, she's okay. In the end, she's okay. And then, in, you know, when she is uh, making the twirl, she has her head. Partially, it disappears. So, these are some of the things that you need to be very, very careful when you are creating your videos so that you can have a very seamless uh, experience. So, you can see that, you no, know, a part of her head here is missing. So, if you're you need to be very careful uh, about this uh, stuff when you are recording your own videos uh, that you want to put inside. Another thing I want to show you is uh, how you can actually use one single video throughout uh, different video settings. Okay, so this uh, girl video, I'm going to keep it the same, but the rest of the background, I'm going to keep changing. But this girl will be twirling and the background will be changing with her. So how we do that is actually we let the video play and we change the background at regular intervals. Okay, we're going to duplicate this page throughout and I am going to change the background of each of these videos. Okay, so but I will change the timing over here. Okay, so she's going to go from 2 seconds to 4 seconds over here at this video. Okay, and I'm going to add another video. I just have to reduce this video size to two seconds also. 
all right i'm going to put another video just wait a minute just okay so i'm going to put another video maybe duplicate this i'll have to transition first match and move and then i'm going to duplicate this this page okay so this girl i'm going to put the timing between uh four and six and after uh changing the background so here i'm just going to move it to the six seconds and from here drag it to four seconds okay same thing i need to change this video here also i need to put it to two seconds okay so now we can press okay transition first and then we can play this video and see how it turns out okay once we start playing you can see that the girl is completing her tool as the background changes so these are some of the ways you can actually incorporate uh, cool videos and you can make cool videos using canva just play around with the settings there are you know like directions you can change you can make changes to the timing you can crop it you can change the transition durations etc etc also you can make it even cooler by actually adding text that will transition together with the videos as well that will actually add more uh, value or more uh, depth to your videos okay as you can see adding these uh, text actually changes this video and uh, you can actually add animation uh, to the text as well another thing i want you guys to take note is that when you're saving save the video that you want as a whole uh, do not save them as separate files keep them together just uh, choose the pages over here okay i want the pages four five and six to be as a single video so i'm going to download them as a single video so uh, make sure you note that don't forget uh, because if you download them as separate videos it's going to be like a separate so it doesn't serve the purpose it doesn't show any transition and stuff like that okay so that's it guys for this video if you would like to improve your canva skills please click on the link in the description box below it is a free 30-day trial to skillshare skillshare offers some cool tutorials where you can pick up basic as well as advanced skills related to canva as well as graphic designing so if you are a beginner looking to learn more about canva or someone who would like to pick up or brush up on your designing skills do take a look make the most of the 30-day free trial by searching for canva on skillshare and you will be able to come across a lot more such courses some of these courses are really short like some courses can be as short as 30 minutes long so make full use of the 30 days free trial and get most value out of it if you would like me to do a video on any canva kdp or pod related content do let me know and i will try my best to incorporate your suggestions Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.